or uh, it's me again, YouTube. Shout out King King Nazareth. So we got some uh, recently got some new information about uh, the sequel to Dragon Ball Z: Battle of the Gods, and it turns out that we got a little bit, a uh, little bit of interesting news. Well, for one thing, uh, Akira Toriyama is definitely going to be very active on this on this next movie. He's going to be taking care of the plot, uh, the story. Uh, the writing very heavily involved, and uh, I think he said I think he said he's gonna spend more time on that than on the artwork, and he just might be a cons an art consultant. So I think that'd be pretty good. So uh, Kira Toyama will be able to sh um, have have more liberty to do his work, and he always does great stuff with Dragon Ball. And let's see what else. He he also said that it was going to be more uh, action oriented than the Dragon Ball Z Battle of the Gods movie. Now honestly, I had no problems with the uh, quantity of action in Battle of the Gods because I know that Dragon Ball is an action comedy series, so it has to have some comedy to it. But uh, if the uh, Kira Toriyama feels that there should be more action, then I'm okay with that. Because I'm sure he'll still keep Dragon Ball's core intact. Now, we don't have much info, info on the plot, but what we do know is that it's going to be that somebody is going to ask Shinron for a wish, and this is supposedly the worst possible wish that anyone could make, and um, uh, this could put the whole entire universe in jeopardy, and all the fans are speculating what could, this could possibly be, like, somebody's, uh, some are saying that maybe, uh, Vegeta wishes to become a Super Saiyan God, though I, I don't really see how that would be a bad thing, since he's pure of heart now. Um, others are saying maybe... Uh, Goku wished for all the parallel universes to merge with into one single universe so he could meet all the other gods and try to compete against them with his Super Saiyan God power. Uh, that might be that might be uh, interesting, but I don't think Goku would do something that reckless. Uh, but who knows? Uh, it would probably put the put the whole cosmos in jeopardy since it will cause the whole uh, cosmos to collapse and become unbalanced. Uh, it might also be that uh, some people are saying that uh, that one of the other gods be brought into this universe uh, for whatever reason. And uh, I'm totally cool with them showing the other gods. And Possibly one that's more powerful and malevolent than Bills. Or, I mean, or Beerus. And this will probably cause Goku to team up with Beerus. And assuming Vegeta gets Super Saiyan God, he might do it. And I, Akira Toriyama also said that he's considering the possibility of bringing more fusion into the, into the movie. So we could probably see the return of Vegeta or maybe even see a Super Saiyan God Vegito and or possibly a Super Saiyan God Gogeta. He could probably make Gogeta canon now. So yeah, this is a uh, pretty interesting stuff. I'll uh, be sure to keep up update when uh when we get some more news. So uh, that's all the things that I got up. And so far, they only got two animation clips for from the teaser trailer, uh, which is just Goku powering up in Super Saiyan form, and uh, Shenron um, looking menacing, but n no more than he usually does. So, yeah. So this is all pretty good stuff, and I'm looking forward to this movie more and more.